everybody. My name is Sarah. Welcome to Kids Following Jesus. We're going to go right into our Bibles this morning to Psalm 23. <clears throat> Let's read it. The Lord is my shepherd. He gives me everything I need. He lets me lie down in fields of green grass. He leads me beside quiet waters. <clears throat> he gives me new strength. He guides me in the right paths for the honor of his name. Even though I walk through the darkest valley, I will not be afraid. You are with me. Your shepherd's rod and staff comfort me. You prepare a feast for me right in front of my enemies. You pour oil on my head. My cup runs over. I am sure that your goodness and love will follow me all the days of my life, and I will live in the house of the Lord forever. <clears throat> so perhaps it would be easier for us to understand some of these verses if you know a, something about shepherds. You see, the individual who wrote this verse is named David, and he at one time was a shepherd. So, knowing about how a shepherd cares for his sheep really helps understand some of the things in the verse. So when it says things like, he leads them to find grass, right? So that's what a shepherd would do. A shepherd would lead the sheep to find grass so that they had a place to eat and they would lead them to water so that they have something to drink. Now, shepherds also, you've probably seen in pictures and illustrations and things like that, they have this, this staff, right? This big hooked like cane thing, right? So they use that to help guide the sheep. So they also use it if a sheep happens to get stuck. So let's say maybe he gets stuck in a bunch of thorns, or maybe he falls into a place that's difficult to then grab him to get him out, right? So then they use that hook of that staff and they can hook the sheep and they can pull them out of that place that they're stuck in back to safety. Now there are other times that with the sheep there are flies or other insects that just cover their faces, right? You can imagine that would be awful. So what a shepherd would do is they would use oil and they would put the oil all over the sheep's face and that would keep the insects off. And that allows then the sheep to lie down and be peaceful. So all of these things are things that are in the verse, right? There's comfort in the rod and staff. Now, when I was younger, I had a hard time with that because I'm thinking rod and staff like that sounds like something you might get whooped with. And that didn't sound very comforting to me. But knowing that a shepherd uses it to help guide and get a sheep out of trouble really helps understand these verses. So hopefully now that you know more about what a shepherd does, you'll better understand how David is using a shepherd and how he cares for his sheep to let us know about the love that God has for each of us. Let's pray together. Dear God, thank you for your love and care through every part of our life. Amen. Thank you for joining me, and I'll be back next week with more Kids Following Jesus.